watching for a review on some of the best and worst aqua doodle art creative drawing pad packs mats okay and i'm also going to share some tips with you so let's get straight into today's video so this is the aqua doodle mat i absolutely love this i've had this for about two years now and all considering it's actually in very good shape it has very good water payoff so the colors are nice and vivid the little paintbrush that comes with i think that's actually quite good it's um you have to keep re-dipping it that's the only thing um it doesn't hold the water very well but i have a tip for you okay if you don't want to give your kids um a lot of water that they can spill or anything there's two things you can do a you can give them a damp cloth and it's actually a great substitute if you've lost any of your other aqua pens but as you can see it can cover a large amount of space this is particularly good for the younger toddlers right it's so much fun and the other thing you can do is you can make yourself your own non-spilled tub so this one is full of water and you can then um, give them a paint slash makeup brush or anything and they can use the water from that to paint i will sh link a video in the description box down below on how to make your own spill free tub but you'd really have to shake this around to kind of get some water out otherwise the water stays in here really well next here i have the tommy aqua doodle i think it's the same make um no book and um, this is brilliant and um, it does come with an aqua marker like this one but um that's been lost long ago i have another one here from melissa and doug and uh, yeah the payoff is pretty decent and it is entertaining enough for the kids i'll use my cloth because this is much damper i find that the cloth works best if you really want to cover a large area now just a quick tip if you want to use this sooner and um, you can dry this using a hair dryer as with anything, if you do use a hairdryer, dry it. Use a hairdryer at a distance on a lower temperature. You just don't want to destroy the integrity of any of these because if you hold the hairdryer too close to dry it, then you run the risk of um, cracking it. Next here, I have the Melissa and Doug Water Wow On The Go Aqua Pads and I absolutely love these. They come with the best water brushes. Okay, a, a lot of water comes out and there's a little brush and you refill it very easy you just unscrew this and you put in the water now after use I would try to remember to try to empty it it's just um, if it's not in use for weeks and it's left damp I'd, it probably could go moldy these are one of the best water pads I've had now over a long period of use it can warp that's expected but like look at that it is so bright and vivid compared to many other um, water pads and it comes out so quick like my daughter absolutely loves this she can't count yet so she can't use um, the connect the dot functions but she loves seeing the big reveal of the picture underneath and it's just such a strong colour payoff I don't know is colour payoff the right term that's probably a makeup term not that I wear makeup but I love this and I love the aqua pen that comes with it this is by far the best and it dries really fast as well so when the girls are finished playing with this I tend to just quickly dab a cloth over it and if I need to dry quickly then I might run um, again the hair dryer over at a far distance to help air dry it a little bit not fully but between dabbing the cloth over and using a bit of hot air on it it'll be dry minutes later you can see already it's starting to kind of dry now the color is lightening up so that's how quick this can dry for the kids because kids want to keep using it again and again just showing you now a bit of warm breath i don't know if you can see but it's already starting to lighten up even more just by lightly blowing on it now i just want to quickly review my least favorite one so this is aqua magic it's in a whole range of different um cartoon brands etc i bought this in kind of the equivalent of pound shop for around 450 euros not particularly cheap and um, considering that the melissa and doug you can get that for in around five pounds 550 
it's only a little bit more expensive but the other one is so much better this one all right the, the color comes up so slow and i just think um the colors really just are not that vivid at all and then the pen all right to fill this up look at the tiny little hole so when i put this under the tap i just have to keep squeezing the air out and release to suck in some water you can equally do that um by filling up a cup and squeezing the air out and filling it up with water but i just find it a bit fiddly and um yeah it's it's not great and to get the water out you really kind of have to keep squeezing it to get some water out and then it's a lot of water if you just draw it like that it's just really not great okay so this is my least favorite but it does do the job but uh, my girls um who are young toddlers the eldest isn't even three yet not really interested in this it's just not very um it's just not very vivid and interesting for younger toddlers maybe for older ones if there's any other aqua book doodle pads mats etc that you do recommend do let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions at all just pop it straight into the comments box any hacks and tips would love for you to share with myself and other moms just again in the comments section down below thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video found it useful please do let me know by giving it a like if you think any other parents will find it useful i'd love for you to share this do share the love so i upload a new video every week on hacks tips and product reviews and for more content like this make sure to click that subscribe button down below if you subscribe you're supporting my channel i need a thousand subscribers before i can monetize and continue to do what i'm doing and sharing all these hacks and tips with you long term so until the next video stay safe wash your hands thank you and goodbye